we are going to be doing some review today. Our first problem says, what digit is in the ones place? Okay, we need to think about when we draw this out, what number is in the ones place? I'm going to go ahead and draw it. So 26. I would have two tens, and I'm going to have six ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so these are the tens. These are the ones. So what number is in the ones place? Again, these are the tens. These are the ones. Well, by asking for the ones place, the numbers that are in the ones place are these. It's the six. We call this digit, when it's in this spot, the ones place. Let's take a look at this next one, 20. And I'm going to draw it, two, zero. There's two tens for 20. There's zero ones. There's zero ones. There's nothing over here. But what number over here is in the ones place? The zero is. The two is in the tens. Because we have two tens and zero ones. Okay, let's try 39. Three tens. Six, seven, eight, nine ones. Okay, so what number is in the ones place? Well, look, oh, these are the tens. These are the ones. These are in the ones place. So that's the nine. The nine is in the ones. Alrighty, here it asks for us to write the number. Well, how much does this guy represent? Ten. So we have 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, let's try one more, but I'm going to change it up on us. Okay, please count that for us. How many is here? Did you say 35? That would be correct. So we have 10, 20, 30. Now we're going to count by ones. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Finally, we're going to write some numbers in expanded form. Okay, what number is in the tens place? Well, that would be the sixes in the tens place, and that would represent 60. Plus, well, how many are in the ones place? One. And that equals how much? 61. Okay, we're going to write 44 in expanded form. Go ahead, tell me what number goes here. We write the number in the tens place first. So 40. What number is in the ones place? That's the 4. So we have 44. On your practice sheet today, it is a review sheet, you will need dice. And the reason why you need dice is because you're going to roll the dice to decide what numbers go here. Okay, so a 5 and a 6. So I would go ahead and draw that. We have five and six. Now I need to build it. Now you can build it with your pieces you have at home in that bag. You could also draw it like we've practiced. So let's go ahead. I'm going to draw it. So five tens, because that's what this shows, five tens. One, two, three, four, five, and six ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to write this out. So five tens is 50. Six ones is six. And then we're going to write these two numbers down here, writing that expanded form. 50 plus six will equal 56. If you don't believe me, we could count it. 
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. So again, you could copy that first one if you'd like to, but you'll be doing the rest of them on your own and you'll need two dice to roll.